Facebook, Facebook, YouTube. This is my uh, Christmas, sorry, my resurrection uh, message right here. Uh, the topic of the message is called the reality of the str- the the reality of a love the the reality love that extends the reality of love that extends you know here's the thing about what I know y'all if some of y'all watched the Passion of Christ and the part when uh, the 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 Roman soldier tried to uh, get Jesus arms to 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 the cross he he found out that Jesus arms was you know could, wasn't capable to reach in the hole of where it's supposed to be nailed at you know what I'm saying he he saw the cross and all oh, but the other I think the higher officer of the Roman uh, army he told them stretch his arms over here yeah, he said, uh-uh, stretch, well, if he, it can't fit, it, it can't, ex- the, the soldier said, well, it can't extend that far, well, then stretch it over there. After that, he got nailed to the other side, he, he told him to stretch Jesus' arms to the other side. You know what I'm saying? And, and he pulled, they, now watch this, the Romans got, got ropes wrapped around Jesus arms to try to extend his arms to that hope and his hands nailed to the other side could you can't imagine that kind of pain but but Jesus said to his disciples that the spirit is willing but the flesh is weak and what I'm trying to say is you know the thing is, you wonder sometimes you know, in your life that, you know, that something you place in a position that when, you know, something God or going to church or going this place where Christian people, that something that somehow, you know, you want to go there, but you have to go beyond. You don't have a drive. You know, your car broke down. Something, you know, is hindering you from going to a person, a Christian's house, you know, a fellowship or something, and and you find yourself in that position, and you wonder like, oh, I guess it's not meant to be or whatever, or you know, for me to go there. But sometimes, sometimes I'm not saying all the time. Sometimes God wants those, those whosoever, to position them, to extend themselves beyond their ability beyond and the only way you can only extend yourself beyond your ability that Jesus went through concerning the cross is of course by faith you can't be by that's why God wants us to live by faith that's why you know without faith we can't please God you know why we can't please God because we cannot extend we are flesh flesh cannot extend the boundaries of the performance that God need us to perform. We going to need his faith to extend to go beyond our, you know, physical ability to his spiritual ability to uh, perform things that God desire us to do. And the thing is, sometimes God puts stuff out there and and and, and, and we like I don't know, I'm not sure we should go for those that have a heart towards him that understand that Jesus show forth a love that extend beyond the physical uh, body that he had to stretch his arms out on the cross knowing that God, God is asking for us because we are Christians like Christ he asking us to extend ourselves beyond our ramifications but in order for extension that I learned start, going to start is faith only faith can extend. And the thing is, only by faith we can truly do the things of God that Jesus is showing us, you know, in his performance. But here's the thing. I'm, this message is encourage you to develop and walk by faith. Faith come by hearing, hearing the word of God. 
Faith is the substance of things hoped for and the evidence of things that are not seen. But only through faith, we can truly love God. And we can only show forth the love that extends as much we develop faith in our lives. That we need to understand if we want to extend and try and strive to give back what the love has been given to us of Jesus Christ dying on the cross for our sins, that we have another chance to go to heaven, we need to learn that we must extend ourselves beyond our spectrum to go closer to Him. We must extend us standing upon the truth, mainly us, standing upon the truth of God's Word and extending ourselves, even though everybody is breaking the line, you know what I'm saying? You stand upon the truth of what God's Word says. And the thing is, you, yes, you will experience resistance, but resistance is a part of extending. You know what I'm saying? And it hurts. Yes, and it hurts. But there's a greater reason.